Hi guys and welcome back to another vlog. Um, I'm heading out to a place nearby that does rubber flooring. Um, I'm looking for floor for the gym area. Uh, I'd like to say a big thank you to John who is our first patron. Um, it's uh, much appreciated. Uh, we are really grateful. Um, so I heading out now and I will film as much as possible. I'm not sure if I can even film there. We'll see. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, I'm uh, back from uh, errands and I have a test piece for the flooring that I just uh, showed you guys. I couldn't feel much in there. I was busy talking actually. <laughs> um, so um, yeah, dogs are happy. I'm back and I'm going to continue working on the uh, bathroom. Well, see, I might even uh, start mounting the door. Uh, no, I won't actually because I want to finish the floor. Um, yeah, so I'm going to check the uh, flooring, how it fits in here uh, with the height, etc. So basically, that's how it's going to be. Um, it's still going to have a gap for the ventilation of the walls, uh, but it won't really be visible. So I think it's gonna turn out great. Um, at the moment, it's, the gap is really visible, but it won't be uh, in the future. So um, I think this floor will be perfect. So today our uh, marble guy is coming to measure the kitchen. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna construct the uh, uh, cabinet that's gonna go here for the uh, toilet as well, so he can do measurements for that. But before, I'm going to do something even more important. I am going to get the barbecue out and make myself a lunch. So I must say this is the single greatest idea I've uh, probably ever had. I'm going to enjoy my lunch here alone in the sun. Uh, this is the progress so far. Not doing much today, barbecuing and a um, bit of a slow day actually, but we will uh, change that in a bit in there. So here we go, lunch with a view and company. Okay, let's dig in. Okay, so I'm gonna construct the cabinet for the bathroom. Um, hopefully, the uh, model guy is coming in a short bit. We'll see. If not, he'll be here, I guess, tomorrow. But anyway, I'm gonna do this now. Hey, Tony. Uh, so, keep the time. Okay, so uh, the drawers are done and as well as the cabinet itself, this is, I built them before and this is the quality I expected from the kitchen, which uh, did not live up to the standard. Um, anyway, um, it will do for the stables. So, this one is done, um, I'm going to start doing the last row of tiles for the bathroom. Yeah, the gym is warm. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a temporary piece, top piece for this, and then attach it, make some measurements. Uh, until I have the marble so that I can do the uh, or at least see how I'm gonna fit the plumbing uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use one of these boards 
which is a bit too thick. Uh, I think we're gonna do 30 millimeter um, marble on top of that, and this is 40. Uh, so um, we'll see how I'll deal with that. I can just mount it one centimeter below, I guess, and then raise it a little bit. Actually, um, I'm not gonna use the new insulation. I'm gonna use uh, the old one because that's 30 millimeter, which is perfect. Uh, it's funny how two dogs can be that different. One is inside, can hardly breathe. The other one is relaxing in the sun, living life. I'm making a mock-up. So basically I've uh, cut this piece, which is gonna sit on top like so a bit of an overhang and then um, then i'm gonna place the sink on top of that and then take some measurements for height etc okay so obviously the uh, plumbing goes straight into this piece which means i have to make a hole there and uh, just cross my fingers that I'm uh, doing this correctly because it's a, it's a one take job. Otherwise I'm gonna have to deal with it. Uh, so here I am in the bathroom uh, with a project that uh, just became uh, slightly bigger than anticipated. When we built this, we did reinforce behind the wall but we did it at a different height because our plan was not to have a top mounted uh, uh, sink like this, which basically means that the cabinet goes a bit further down, um, but that was decided afterwards we put this wall up. So now I'm gonna have to cut open some openings on both sides. Uh, then put reinforcements in from the front and then put the plaster boards back on with uh, plaster. So a, a fun little project ahead. Okay, so this is an absolute nightmare. Um, I don't have any fixing points. Uh, and if I want to put it centered between here and there, this is basically where it needs to be going, which is nothing behind. So what I have to do is then open up the plasterboards, put pieces behind and then close it. It's not a big deal, but it's uh, it's um, gonna take me a bit a while. Uh, the other idea I have is to shift it, which I prefer, is to shift it, which I think was the original idea, I can't even remember, to have it centered in fr right in front of the toilet so that the center of the toilet is centered with the sink, which basically means I have fixing points on this side. Um, I couldn't find any behind here, but I can use the same principle as I explained, uh, where I open up the plasterboard, put something behind and then close it. Um, so that is probably the, the route I'm going to go for, which basically means that hole needs to be five centimeters that way. So I'm going to have to uh, do some work on that. It's not a big deal, but it's another job. Um, I'm going to start with the flooring, the last pieces. But before that, I need to unpack the door in order to see what kind of uh, uh, ledge is gonna go down there. I'm not sure. Uh, so I'm gonna see um, how that's done because when it comes to doors, uh, Italy is very different to the rest of the world. Uh, they usually open the doors inwards. They don't use any... Uh, What's that piece called? I'm a bit too tired. Uh, yeah, the uh, ledge thingy. 
Um, so, um, yeah, I need to unpack the door and see what's going on. Okay, um, in order to do one thing, I have to do 6,000 different things before. Uh, so this little project uh, with the uh, cabinet, that's on hold because I want to do the flooring first. To do the flooring, I need to know exactly where the floor ends because they don't use uh, thresholds or uh, door steps here in Italy, which is uh, great. Um, so uh, in order to do that, I need to mount the, or at least know where to put the uh, door. Uh, this little piece is thicker than my wall is, which basically means I'm gonna have to make the wall thicker. In order to make the wall thicker, I need to put another layer of plasterboard because I only used single layer, which I usually never do, but for some reason I did. Um, so yeah, this is gonna take me a while. Okay, um, so this is gonna be a uh, bit of a job which uh, is not for today. I'm gonna end it. Um, it's such a nice weather, I'm gonna go for a walk instead. Uh, so I'm gonna end the daily vlog here. And I'll... Uh... God, it's really warm. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Ciao.